。香港人咩都要快，翻工要快，放工要快，食饭要快，过马路要快，就连呼吸都要快。压力指数爆煲，情绪病患者年轻化。你有冇谂过，除咗镇静剂同埋安眠药，仲有咩方法可以帮我哋减压？减压。Hey, hi, my name is Ayelet Idan. I'm from Israel. I live in Hong Kong for 15 years. And I'm running olive leaf. It's cooking class and cooking therapy,、uh, mostly on Lawa. Ayala 嚟自以色列，居港十五年，一直都住喺南丫岛。喺家乡连手机都几乎唔用嘅佢，非常习惯简朴嘅生活。阿伊力住嘅北角村位置偏远，居民平日只能坐街度往返香港仔。岛上冇餐厅，冇商铺，最近嘅一间邮局、银行都要步行至少三十分钟，所以就算星期六日呢度都好少游客。阿耶林屋企今日就好热闹，因为有几个女仔专登长途跋涉嚟揾佢学整特色素菜，顺便帮自己减减压。阿耶林好亲切，对访客招呼周到。不过佢屋企就有一个需要大家严守嘅家规。Our house is vegetarian. We don't bring into the house any animal like meat or you know seafood or fish or anything like that. And my children was born and raised as vegetarian. Many many years ago, I used to be a special needs teacher for people like children with severe kind of、uh, issues, and I used to work also with a, in a shelter for children、uh, that've been taken out for the houses because they've been abused. So, and we always naturally use cooking because it was something that you can do together, and children love it, and children like to make things. So, I think naturally you're doing it without even thinking many times, even with your own children or with. Even some people coming and you're doing it together. I was thinking it's a really good tool, and I saw how people, most people, drawn to that.、Uh, even you don't need to have passion for cooking. I mean, it's we all eating, we all smelling, we all touching food every day. So I know it's a tool that could work on most people. Cooking therapy, 烹饪治疗，顾名思义，系透过烹调食物嘅过程。梳理情緒同心理問題，就好似藝術治療、戲劇治療、遊戲治療等，利用唔同嘅媒介幫助我哋打開心扉。烹飪治療相對於坐喺心理諮詢室，少咗一份壓迫感。參與者喺料理嘅過程中，好容易放鬆心情。而呢種治療喺外國已經流行咗十幾年。美国芝加哥学院亦有开设相关课程，不过喺香港就未算普及。It's not a cooking class, so you don't you don't have to in the end of the process. It's not like you need to learn to make thing or you can produce some certain food. It's not. It's not. It's not. And sometimes you know, sometimes you're making something and you don't eat it. And sometimes you make, they, we make something in the cooking therapy, and people decide to give it to somebody else. So it's not a cooking class. It's it's very different than a cooking class. And sometimes we will not even have a product in the end. We will use ingredients. We will touch it. We will mix things, but we might not have like a product that you can eat in the end. So it's very different than a cooking class. I would say it's very different in a way, but it's very different, but not different at all. You know what I mean? It's it's both.、Uh, I would say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's dealing with human being, and yeah, just seeing them and see what they need, and follow that, and helping them to get to their potential or what they want from themselves. So I think, in a way, there is not such a big difference. Depends. I mean, cooking therapy you can do it either one on one or sometimes there is a group、uh, therapy. So yeah, I think most of it, it's you're learning about yourself, you're learning about what's stopping you, what's 
what is the thing that uh, trigger you? I mean, you're learning through that a lot about yourself and how to deal with that as well. I mean, I'm not saying it's always successful, but it is a process that helping you to learn about yourself and what you need. So you have to have, it's, it's not one time and that's it. I mean, there are some workshops that you're doing a little bit of that to kind of connect people or sometimes there is a different, you can use it in different ways, but if you're going through a real process, it has to be at least 10 meeting and it's once a week and it's in the same time. It's like any other therapy. Uh, it's like, you know, and it's always have the same beginning, the same end. It's very organized kind of process. So, uh, so it's usually yeah, once a week and it, it, it's need at least, I would say, 10 meetings, something like that. So. Sogon Um, I did a work with a group of women uh, in a rehab place and I really saw how it was it was amazing change I just saw it uh, it was it I, I was myself like every time coming back home, I was like wow so so many things came up you know and people was sharing more and more things and and suddenly they learned how to look at themselves through the cooking and they even said to me many times say wow we didn't think about looking at that like that or thinking about it and in the end, I just saw how some of them really improved and they gave them, it gave them a few more tools to understand themselves and to deal with some stuff that they've been through. So they feel more comfortable, you know what I mean? It's coming, it's coming both ways. Either people like taking the time with me or because I'm not local, they know I'm not coming from the culture. I will not judge them like a local person maybe will be. So because I don't even understand this culture. I don't hold a cooking therapy session in, in my house as it has to be in a separate place that have no connection to me and not connection to the people that are coming, and take, uh, coming to the session. So it's usually I'm just renting a place, make it very cozy and very pleasant place to be. The Hong Kong Chai Ma Hui Fangzi Zisa Yen Gao Zhong Sum has a very good review. 2003年至今已經錄得306宗學童自殺個案,當中37人死亡,最年輕的只有13歲,對於香港自殺個案年輕化,曾經任職教師的Yellow感到好痛心,佢認為連子人嘅壓力源頭,好大程度係來自香港
眼见香港对情绪病患者支援不足，虽然身为犹太人，阿耶律都好想为香港尽一份力。奈何大部分洗福机构都遵从传统嘅治疗方针，就算佢多次提出无偿工作，都被一一拒诸门外。Even when I was doing practicum for my study, I was going to so many places and many places like no, 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 no. They didn't even want to hear me because for them, I mean, cooking therapy it's quite new even in the West.、Uh, but in Israel, I would say it's something like 15 years. And in Israel, actually, they have in the school, they open in the school like、uh, therapeutic kitchen, and they're using it in schools and they're using it in old people home and、uh, rehab places. They they create a place to that. So in Israel, it's very open. But many things about.、Um, I say welfare and and、um, and emotional stuff. It's very open in Israel. I think here the culture is a bit different. So I felt like many places that I want to even offer them for free just to kind of because I need to practice、It、was like no no no. It was too scary for them. Something I never heard about and、um, a bit not、uh, the mainstream. I think some people need it. I don't say it's、yeah. not needed, but I think there is some issue that you can solve in different ways.、Uh, Some people maybe need both. You, yeah, you take the pills just to survive now the near time, just to kind of make you feel better that you will not do something. But then it's not enough to take a pill. It's not solving the problem. Since the war broke out, the Israeli military says it had hit over 400 Hamas targets and killed dozens of militants overnight. Because of the home's war, the mother has a new understanding.阿耶律坦言，近日算系佢人生嘅低潮。不过作为治疗师，佢清楚明白人就会有情绪，收收埋埋只会令问题变得更加复杂。如果你发现自己受情绪困扰，记住要尽快寻求专业嘅情绪辅导。After working from Monday to Friday, I think a place like this would would help a lot, just to calm your mind. And because、yeah. I like cooking, so I feel like this this is a good place to focus.